Dick Grayson studying on a s Saturday night. So, Dick, how's your chemistry class coming? Jumping Jehoshaphat's, uh, Bruce. Uh, I, I don't get any of this at all. Uh, they talk about all these It's not that hard. You break it down. Break it down to balance the equation. For instance, over here we have hydrogen and oxygen, two elements of hydrogen. See, it's the ions. It's the plus and... I think it's the door. Master Wayne, you have a caller, a gentleman by the name of Dr. Victor Von Fries. Send him in. It looks like you're going to have to postpone your homework now, Dick. <sighs> oh, well, that man. <laughs> I'm not... Remember, Dick, it's Bruce right now. It's not Batman. Greetings, Miss, Mr. Wayne. Uh, greetings. Victor Von Fries is my Hi, name. Victor. Hello. And you must be... This is my ward, Dick Grayson. Hello, Dick. He's Hello. currently working on his chemistry homework. Homework? A little, a little young shot, eh? All right, keep back. So what, uh, what can we do? Uh, Dick, excuse me. Can I, can I offer to get you a drink or something? Oh, no, I can't. I'm in a rush. Have a seat. Yes. It's very, very interesting... What's going on here? So I'm sure you've heard of my uh, generous donation to the uh, Opera House. Well, that's what brings me out here. I would like a donation to for my opera. Well, the Wayne Foundation has pledged one million dollars under one consideration. Yes. We do not want our name associated. We don't want a, our name in the Why program. is that? That is very... We try to keep both these matters aloof. It's, it's not for tax purposes. It's not for showmanship. It's that I we, would think believe, a, we believe in your cause. I've, I appreciate that. But I would think a man of your caliber, millions and millions of dollars, would want the publicity in the press. Oh my god, no publicity. You do realize you will be getting free season tickets to the opera. Don't worry about it. Unless, hey Dick! Dick! Yeah? Would you like to go to the opera? Uh, What's your current production? <laughs> oh, it's a lovely one! We are currently doing Guys in Tights! I love Do you it. want to see the opera guys in tights? Uh, only if you want to, Bruce. You know what? A boy like you should get an education in opera. We'll take two. I must say one thing, though. It is very warm in here. I think you should turn... I think I will take that drink. Alfred, can you bring a drink? Absolutely. Thank you very much. It'll be nice and cold. Freezing cold, I should say. Here you are, sir. Master, you'll have a phone call. No, we wanted a drink for our guest here. It's a phone call, Master. A phone call. I'll tell him to take a message. I'm here with Mr. Phil. The other phone call. What other phone? <laughs> the other phone. What other phone? The other one. Unless it's the bat phone. Excuse me. Dick! To my... <coughs> Hello, Commissioner Gordon. Hello, Batman. It's Commissioner Gordon. We have an urgent message for you. Evidently, Mr. Freeze and the Riddler are taking over the special diamonds that can charge up Mr. Freeze's superpower laser. It's Mr. Freeze and the Riddler. What happen are you there? I'm here. What happens is, they're going to try and attack in the uh, within the hour. We must stop them immediately. It and you must go as you know who. Who else would I go as? Batman and Robin. <laughs> That's who I always go as. Please come right away. Oh my God! It's Mr. Freeze and the Riddler, and they've come and they've and they've altered Commissioner Gordon's brain. We better get to the Bat Cave. Sounds like a good plan, Batman. We haven't one moment to lose. Crystals, 
and force them to be frozen solid. And then we will own Gotham City. It's really a good plan. When we nab Batman and Robin, riddle me this, Mr. Freeze, what will we do with them? What will we do with them, Fiddler? We'll take Batman and Robin and freeze them solid. And then, destroy them! Ha! They will be so cold. And it will be a cold day in Gotham City. <laughs> How are we going to climb this, Batman? We're going to use my bat rope. Take out a batarang. Uh, this building is super tall, Batman. Super tall isn't isn't enough words to describe it. Gosh darn it. I'm slipping, Robin. Uh, Stand clear. We will get that, Mr. Freeze. Ah. Uh, uh. Climb through. Go on, old chump. Uh, uh, All right. Uh, All right. Let's get him. The gig is up, Riddler and Mr. Freeze. Batman and Robin, we've been expecting you. Riddle me this, caped crusader, and riddle me that, boy wonder. What do you get when you put a T in front of rap? Holy ambush, Batman! We're trapped! What was that, Robin? We're trapped! T with wrapped after it is trapped! You're right, T with wrapped after it is trapped! Let's get him! Tune in, same bat time, same bat channel. When we last left off, our two heroes were frozen to the wall. Mm. I can't move, Robin, how about you? Jumping Jehoshaphat, I can't either! Batman and Robin, it looks like we have finally destroyed you. You didn't destroy anybody. Looks a little frozen to me. I feel a little frozen. Well, I have a question for you, Robin. When was the last time you've had cold... Turkey. At Aunt Harriet's 50th birthday brunch. Well, you will now be frozen, Robin, like a frozen turkey, Batman. Haha, <laughs> I will set this timer, and in two minutes, you'll be frozen shut. Have a nice day. Is there any way out of this? Fortunately or unfortunately, yes, there is a way out of this boy wonder, but first, riddle me this. What do you get when an elephant sits on a dock? Elephant in a dock. Oh, this was a chem problem. Oh, what was it? Think of your studies, boy wonder. Combustion! That's the answer. We have to start a fire, Batman. How are we going to start a fire? There's some flares in my bat shorts. I'm frozen like
like a turkey bird. How did they do this? That's a great question. I don't know. Good I job, boy wonder. Chief O'Hara and Commissioner Gordon are on their way to get those thugs back to an asylum. But how did you do that, Batman? Oh, the solution's easy, boy wonder. It's like studying camp. What I did was I found a microchip underneath my tonsil. I took a little lint from underneath my toenail. I realized that the microscopic particles, when put together, can create a combustion. I stuck them between my ass cheeks. <laughs> we were able to escape. The, the combustion bounced off the walls, and I know that both, uh, both Mr. Freeze has a little metal in his costume, and Midler has a metal plate in his down below area. It went boom, and he stuck over to there. Holy combustion, Batman! Whoa, Robin, you've been watching way too much Mr. Science. That language doesn't count. You don't want Aunt Harriet to hear that. She'll give you a whipping again like she gave you last Sunday, and you remember you're still in pain from that. Good work. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> uh, let's go back to... John Tennant as Robin. Rich Zolankiewicz as the Riddler. Kenny Goldstein as Mr. Freeze. Jason Goldstein as Batman. See you next week, folks. These freaking boxes don't open. Damn that Joker. It must be a penguin conspiracy, you freaking...